the sneakers will still squeak. Shots will still swish. The only difference this season is the boys and girls' new basketball coaches. Uh, we're probably going to run a lot of the same, um, you know, we're probably going to run a lot of the same thing. We're trying to keep the, the changes as minimal as possible, but uh, I think I'll probably be a little more uh, defensive-minded than perhaps teams in the past have been. Coach Fishhaber is looking forward to this year with a lot of seniors. Well, we're really fortunate in that we've got a lot of girls returning. Um, we'll have an older team this year. We'll be very heavy with seniors, so we're very experienced. We've been to a uh, district championship last three years in a row. And on the boys' side of the court, Coach Alderson talks about the pressures of coaching in the season they have ahead of them. It feels good. I think maybe it's a little more pressurized. I've been uh, teaching here for quite some time, but I've been coaching here for 18 years, so I've, I've been around. Uh, I haven't been the head coach, but I've been part of a lot of the uh, programs and a lot of the head coaching responsibilities. But uh, there's, there's definitely uh, a lot of work for us to do. With the young team behind them, Coach Alderson knows that they have to strive to be the best that they can be. Our expectations this year for this team is to improve every day. I think that this year is going to be a year of how we respond to First of all, a very tough schedule. Uh, we are young, we are inexperienced. With the season just beginning, these coaches are strategizing and readying their players for unknown territories. They lead their teams into a new season with new coaches and new goals. Weston Cowan, DTV Sports.